Did I just pass out on my couch for an hour and a half while my son watched Paw Patrol? Yes. <laughs> and uh, no, I do not have any shame about that because I was tired, except I must have slept in a really strange position because I have the worst crick in my neck right now that hopefully does not last too long because it is painful, man. Um, okay, so today is Clean Beauty Box Day and I thought I would do a nighttime routine with you guys. So I'm doing nighttime skincare. It is nighttime actually. I'm using some lights, uh, my mirror, my Ricky. My Ricky loves Ricky mirror, so hopefully it's not too bad. And right now I'm actually using the Flower and Spice exfoliator that came in last month's box um, to sort of prep my skin for the rest of the skincare, which isn't actually gonna be that much. I'm keeping it kind of light. Um, but yeah, I'm also doing this on my phone, so we'll see how <laughs> how this turns out. And because um, I don't, I don't usually film on my phone. I don't think I've ever posted a video on my phone. But just sort of like positioning wise, the phone on my Ricky mirror was kind of like you know the best option here. And um, it's kind of it's like impossible to not look at yourself. But if I look at myself, it looks like I'm looking away. And then there's the camera. <laughs> so while I let this sit for another minute, let's talk about the box this month. The theme this month, <clears throat> if I can open it, is Beauty Sleep, which these are nighttime products, so that is why I chose to do this. So Beauty Sleep. And they're both from the brand Amly, which we have seen before in the Clean Beauty box. They did feature their uh, mist. It was like the City Mist and the Brightening Serum, I think, or is the Defense Serum. So they've, they have been featured before. These are products that I don't think that I've tried, at least I know I haven't tried this one. Though I am thinking that the Beauty Sleep Mist was featured in a Box Walla box previously. But yeah, that's what comes in it. It's the Sleep Tight reju Rejuvenating uh, rejuvenating Face Balm, which strengthens, renews, and refines with anti-aging propolis. So then we'll talk about that. And then it's the Beauty Sleep Silver Rich Face Mist with anti-aging snow algae to boost skin repair and longevity. So let's talk about the bomb first. It is an $87 value and then the mist is a $21 value. So it's a little bit over a $100 value for the box. So it's a rejuvenating face balm and mask that strengthens, refines, and renews your complexion while you sleep. This serum-like balm nourishes dry winter parched skin with powerful vitamins and fatty acids. Star ingredient propolis extract has been scientifically proven to reduce the depth and volume of crow's feet wrinkles by up to 26% with lipid restoring natural waxes. So there's propolis extract, which helps protect skin from oxidative stress and anti with antimicrobial quercetin, oh my neck is really bothering me. Kukui seed oil helps protect against cell damage from environmental free radicals. Barrage seed oil soothes, softens, and rejuvenates the complexion. Fire, uh, fireweed stem extract provides antioxidant properties and argan oil tightens skin and improves elasticity. So you apply it to cleanse skin before bed, Massage product into face and neck using upward strokes for optimal beauty sleep effect. Apply after misting the beauty sleep face mist. Um, so there's all kinds of stuff in here. There is shea in here. Um, sweet almond, vegetable glycerin, sunflower. There's rose hip, evening primrose, kukui, argan, heliochrysum, sea buckthorn, Roman chamomile, ylang ylang, frankincense, rose geranium, clary sage, lavender, just to name a few, there is, there's quite a lot of things in here. So here is the, let's clean it off a touch. Here is the bomb. And then here is what it looks like inside. It's another one of those like sort of semi-firm bomb states. It's not like completely solid, but it's not like a liquid. It is a sort of like, like a thick, like a thick serum, I guess would be the best way to describe it. And it does, it does have a pretty strong scent to me, though I'm not sure of what in particular, because there's so much stuff in here. It doesn't really smell like of any one thing. But I mean, it does have, for those who are concerned about scent, it does have a pretty, a pretty strong scent, I think. Um, so then the other one is the Beauty Sleep Face Mist which is formulated with rejuvenating botanicals to prep your skin and support natural healing sleep. It boosts cellular repair and activates overnight collagen production while soothing the mind and relieving tension. 
So it's got snow algae, which activates overnight collagen production and cellular repair. Passion flower and valerian root extracts helps relieve tension. Clary sage and linden essential oils quiets the mind and soothes stress. Rose quartz and rose rose. Rose rose, is that a thing? Or is it supposed to be rose something else? Rose oil. <laughs> Um, imbues warmth and provides comfort. Comfort. So this has got neroli, geranium, aloe, frankincense, Roman chamomile, valerian, ylang ylang, linden, um, rose geranium, clary sage, lavender, green tea, passion flower, tulsi, St. John's wort, snow algae. I don't see the, maybe it's the rose geranium. Is that what it's supposed to be? I don't know. There might be a typo. I'm not really sure. Um, so yeah, and then this is not the full size. It is just one of those more, it's a deluxe size, one ounce instead of, I think it, I think the full size is like a three, three, three and a half ounce or 3.4 ounce. And this sort of has the same scent. So if you're familiar with the beauty sleep scent, that is what the, the balm uh, smells like. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, remove this, which has now like fully absorbed in. <laughs> and um, then we'll get on with the, Bomb and whatever whatever else I'm gonna do to my skin today. All right, so at nights lately, while I've been testing this and the uh, the other couple of bombs that have shown up this month, it's been pretty bomb heavy. Um, I've been trying to do some during the day and some at night to sort of you know be able to test both. So I've been trying to use this one at night and the others um, really during the day. But um, I've been keeping it pretty light, like skincare wise, because I don't want to overdo it. So really, all I've been doing is a hydrating step and then I do the bomb. So. I'm doing either one of two things right now. I'm using the Josh Rosebrook Hydration Boost Concentrate or I'm using the Pi Back to Life Serum. I think today I'm just going to use the Josh Rosebrook. I don't think my skin needs a ton, ton of moisture. So spray some of this. I thought the, thought the kitten came in here. And then I use a couple drops of the Hydration Boost concentrate hopefully I haven't been looking at myself too much I'm really trying hard <laughs> it's just distracting in the iPhone but I don't know if the quality's not too bad maybe I'll film some videos on my iPhone in here every once in a while we'll see maybe start vlogging because I have a vlog camera, it's the G7X2 Mark II, whatever, it's the Canon one, the vlog camera, um, and I like it, but sometimes like, I don't want to like whip out my camera, like say when I'm, I don't know, when we're somewhere, like Oliver's swim class or something, like if I ever wanted to like video him, I don't want to whip out my vlog camera, and if the, if the, if the iPhone camera is just as good, maybe we'll just do that from now on. Okay, so we're going to spray... My eyes also really bother, bothering me. It's like I have something stuck in it, but like no matter how much I clean it, it never, uh, it never goes away. And I did, I just changed these contacts too, so. All right, so next we're just gonna do the mist. It is a very fine mist. I love that. I love the fine mists. And then I'm just gonna take some of the the bomb. I'm not sure how much until I really like get into it. No, that's probably enough. Is that upward strokes? Some days I like, I'll do the whole like, you know, like this kind of thing. And then other times I just like throw it around. <laughs> just sort of depends on my mood, how tired I am, how quickly I want to go to bed. So I do think that this would probably make, you know, I think all the bombs this month would make, um, you know, good for gua sha. You know what? Maybe we'll do that a little bit. Let's do some gua sha. I'll use my stone that came in a past clean beauty box. I haven't done gua sha in a while. So usually I just get ready super late at night and I like just want to get it done. But I know like how good it is for my skin. My skin really, really loves it. I need to do that this month too. I need to do my how I use my beauty tools video that I've been talking about for ages. 
this month I might actually get a lot of stuff done that I've been talking about because I have so many days <laughs> of content that I need to fill. I love doing um, my cheek and shit area, especially for like a long time. I don't know why. It just feels so good to just like swipe. This is my kind of swiping. You know, not Tinder. <laughs> you never know which is the best way to do the forehead. And that's about what I do for gua sha, you know, sort of like a quick, quick version um, if I only want to spend a couple of minutes on it. But sometimes I could sit there and I could do that for like a long time. So I just, I love the feeling. And like some stones I like better than others, like that one. I'm not sure where it is right now, but the one that I got from Mahalo um, has like the perfect curvature for my face. And it just, it glides like so smoothly over my face. That one, it's a little bit harder to maneuver. Um, and I'm not sure if she, if uh, Clean Beauty Box even sells those anymore, but if they do, I'll link them below in case you're interested in a gua sha stone. Um, I know Audacity also has a gua sha stone, but it's like humongous. Um, it's just sort of like what everybody, everybody's gonna prefer sort of like a different shape and like what works best for them. So that's everything that I've got for the Clean Beauty Box this month. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you're looking for sort of like perfect winter nighttime products, the Clean Beauty Box has sort of got you covered this month. Um, they're really like, I, all of the boxes this month just have like such beautiful bombs. You know, the Hanua Balm is new and it's like blue tansy and it's perfect for sensitive skin and perfect for, you know, they're all really perfect for dry winter skin because they're all really like thick and like emollient and just perfect for this kind of climate because they they really do just like moisturize your skin very nicely. So it's really just going to depend on sort of what you're looking for. Um, the Amley one, you know, is supposed to strengthen and refine. The um, the the one from Boxwalla, the La Par Balm, is really great for sensitive skin. That one also is sort of like a really great does it all balm because it's great for all skin types. And then the Hanua Balm is really great for like sensitive and acne prone skin. So it really is just gonna depend on what you're looking for this month. All boxes are still available. The Clean Beauty Box did just open today, but um, I believe the Box Walla Box is still available and the Beauty Heroes one has not sold out yet. So if you're interested in any of them, you know, now that you've gotten my review of all three, maybe you wanna pick one because three bombs is a lot in a month. But if you have any questions about anything from today or any of the boxes, just sort of like let me know. And then now that we've finished the review of the box, we'll talk about today's giveaway, which is with the Clean Beauty Box. Together with the Clean Beauty Box, we are gifting to one of you guys a two month subscription. So you will get the December box and the February box. This one is open for US only. So if you are looking for an international giveaway, check out my Box Walla box and Red Apple Lipstick because those ones are both open internationally. And I will have some more international ones this, um, you know, this month. I will have a few more, not a ton, but I will have a few. Because I do want to make sure to include, you know, those of you who have supported me from afar. <laughs> um, but yeah, check out all the information for the giveaway and any other links down below. Um, the question of the day will be down there. And I hope that you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in my next one.